Have you heard the one about the Mexican fighter who quit? No, because it never happened and it never will. Why? Porque puro machismo. It's unmistakable. You see it, you feel it, you know it. The strong, aggressive toughness in the ring. Face to face, toe to toe, eye to eye. Mano a mano, you hit me, I hit you. Best man wins. End of story. Born and raised in East LA. Watch fights from the Grand Olympic Auditorium, cheering from the cheap seats. And ringside, my living room floor, front and center of our old black and white television. Watching fighters making sports history. Mexican greats, like Antonio Barrera. Eric Morales, and of course, the great lion of Culiacan, Mexico, Julio Cesar Chavez. So, after Canelo Alvarez, who's gonna be the next great Mexican fighter? Me? I think it's this kid from Nogales. Described as human dynamite. An undefeated record fought to a win after his jaw was broken. Said it made him stronger. A bloodbath. What I think you're seeing tonight is the emergence of Oscar Valdez as a great fighter. Lives with scorpions and snakes in the hottest, meanest desert in all of Mexico. Swims with a 14-foot crocodile. <laughs> He's so mean and cold-blooded. They call him a reptile, the reptile. Big combination from the Mexican fighter. This fight's so over. How about you throw the guy down? And still undefeated, Oscar. Oscar Valdez, made in Mexico.